All right. G20 leaders, we want you to stop funding fossil fuels. It's time has already run out and we've got to save the climate. Think about a climate de-risking instrument. Think carefully about how to promote sustainable infrastructure and particularly the sustainability of infrastructure, both in an environmental and social terms. G20. We want you to promote a development model that meets the needs of the poor, that is sustainable and respects their human rights. Ihr G20 Länder müsst anerkennen, dass das neoliberale Wirtschaftsmodell nicht funktioniert, dass sich dadurch die soziale Ungleichheit verschärft. Stop the uh, strong push for public-private partnerships to finance infrastructure projects and to uh, expose all the risks and financial problems that these deals have. You need to have a democracy overhaul. You should uphold the highest standards of transparency. Instead of assuming everything is secret, everything should be public. Any of your uh, so-called projects that you want to really reach the beneficiaries that they consider their social and environmental concerns and that they really benefit from any of the results of the projects that you will be undertaking. We want you to prioritize community-led development, the development that the local communities actually want that will improve their lives. Look at facilities to finance or fund good strategic environmental and social assessments that provide for better risk allocation down the line. G20. You should think about that international human rights and environmental agreements are central to every aspect of its discussions including around financing for infrastructure investment. I want you to make sure that the financial sector, it is the investors, the banks, uh, the pension funds, are financing sustainable uh, projects, sustainable companies, and include uh, all the people so that uh, we have a sustainable economy and society. We want you to make girls' education a priority at the Hamburg G20. I want you to promote responsible business conduct throughout global supply chains in G20 countries by requiring that companies do mandatory due diligence throughout their supply chains to detect, prevent and mitigate human rights abuses. A lot of asks, but the demand is immediate.